Hi guys! Merry Christmas everyone! I hope you're all having a wonderful day. And today I'm going to show you some stuff that I got for Christmas. Now, this stuff is not everything I've got for Christmas. I'm just showing you what I got for part of my shoes collections. Now the first two I'm going to show you were not for Christmas. Like, but none of you have seen them yet. So I'm gonna go with my Converse first. And these are the all black Chuck Taylors. These were meant to be my um, 50th pair, but um, I got rid of a pair, so they are now the 49th pair of Converse. And they're, they're very different to what comrades I've always worn because they're quite shiny. They're all in black and I kind of wish I had these for school now because they're like all in black. And I probably, probably could have got away with these. Plus my cat in the hat black ones were like almost all black but they weren't all black and I really like the all black. So that's the converse. The next thing I'm going to show you are not converses, but they're a pair of Doc Martens. And the laces are part of what I got today for Christmas. And these are the green Joker, Hulk, Slimer, Loki Doc Martens. Now I got these two days before I went on holiday where I got my Traeger stuff. Now the laces were what I got for Christmas but I will show you. These are eBay bought as you can tell because I not worn this long. These Doc Martens get the most complimented because they're just so quirky compared to all the other shoes they're just so different they're like beauties i think i'm gonna show you all the dot martins first because i've only got like three of them i'll tell you but i have now got 17 pairs of dot martins so the first pair i'm gonna show you uh i've got two new low tops are the flower low tops as you guys know that my black ones are huge they're huge compared to these ones they're huge so uh, getting another pair of low tops with a feminine touch to it this time is probably better because the black ones are huge i love them to bits but they're just so big and they're chunky and i have to wear like three socks speaking of socks i've got a pair of thick fluffy socks so these and socks are going to be so cool they are probably ebay bought as well all three of them look ebay bought but the one pair looks in such good quality that you wouldn't know oh and the purple ones but these are eBay bought. I can't tell much on them yet because I've not worn any of them yet. But they are beautiful. I'm not going to lie, but I'm actually in shoe heaven at the moment. But mum has got me some such cool shoes. I have now got 17 dot mines and 54 pairs of converse. The next pair I'm going to show you are a painted purple. I want to change the laces on these to the quirky ones, but the quirky laces are quite long. So they would make them... Hey! I will change the laces on my fair ones, so... And I'll get the same colour. Or maybe not. But these are painted purple. Lately, if I'm being honest, I haven't go get nothing for the painted pairs of Doc Martens. And the painted purple are actually quite different. 
No, I think the painter pads are more likely to get um, beaten up. But these ones are in such good quality that you wouldn't even know they're probably from eBay. Because they're in such good quality. They're, they're technically beautiful. And uh, I love Doc Martens and Converse because these painted Doc Martens, the green ones, actually probably express my personality the most. But wait until you see the next ones. I think they actually express my personality more than the green ones. And these ones are what the next colour is that you wouldn't expect people to wear. And they are the yellow ones. Sometimes I look at my Doc Martens and I think, have they shrunk or do I just have really small feet? I figured I've just got really small feet. These are the painted yellows. Now, I know my green ones get complimented, but I think these ones are going to get a heck of a load. The yellow ones look quite new, so, um, so I'm excited uh, to wear these. I don't actually know which pairs of Doc Martens I want to wear to take to my nan and granddad, because I'm just love them all so much at the moment i'm yearning towards the purple ones but i'm gonna have a look on pinterest because i love pinterest pinterest is the best if you want something to look on for an outfit that you're struggling on go on pinterest i'll go on pinterest more than i go on instagram and facebook but these are the yellow dot martins and they are just so fun I might change, I might not change the laces. And the next thing that I'm going to show you before I go to the Converse is uh, some stuff that I'm not shoe sure related. So these are the socks I've got. Now I'm not going to lie but I love socks. I'm always losing my socks. So thick socks are probably really cool because I could probably wear these with a pair of Doc Martens. And I'm going to wear a pair of leggings instead of tights today because I can't actually find my tights. I hope I do because but then I can't be bothered to wear tights. Don't ask why. So these are socks. I love socks. I'm a complete nerd. And the next thing that I got, which I'm really happy for because I can't actually find my old one, is uh, the bracelet wheel. Friendship wheel super cool super awesome i've never had the square one i've always had the wheel so i know how to use the wheel quite well i just need to learn how to use the square i've been taking these to my nan and granddad so i will figure out myself and this is for my amazon or ebay i can't remember which the next thing i'm going to show you is a dress I got from New Look. The t-shirt is downstairs, but the dress is like green, a gorgeous green. Almost a Loki green. They're gorgeous dress. Lately, green has been quite a cool colour for me. I'd never thought I would like the colour green, in my honesty. But, I'm going to fold this up because it's so long. Lately, I've just really liked the colour green. They're just... Maybe it's that year when I am phased with the colour green. The next thing is where I got the Dr. Martin's laces. They're like Converse laces, but I thought... <sighs> this laces will last me my whole life. They were bad filled with them. And some of them are the same colours, but they're just so cool. I was with joy when my mum got me laces. I'm like, oh, MG, thanks, mum. Because some of my Converse are actually laces lost. And I really needed laces for them. So seeing these laces, I was so happy. Now, moving on to the all the Converse's that I got for Christmas. 
I don't know which one to show you first, but I think I might show you the slightly newer pair. I don't know if Mum got them on the website or if she got them on eBay or not. But these are like brand new. They look brand new. And these have a yellow Chuck Taylors too. High tops. I've got a red low tops. Lately I've been after the colour yellow and orange for Converse. So when I saw these I thought super cool. Now my favourite thing with them, the Chuck Taylors too is you can actually take the bottoms out and I tend to do that if um, the sides are rubbing me. But these are like Simpson. they're like swiped, they're swiped. Dot Converse. If I've been saying Dot Martens, I'm sorry. But these are Converse Chuck Taylors too, and I was well happy when I saw these. I was like, oh my god, mum, I'm so thank you so much. I'm so happy. And these are like super cool. The next thing I'm gonna show you are uh, the low top. Chuck Taylor's one and they're like a bleach yellow and I thought these were super cool because I actually love quirky laces and they've got like skull and cross laces and I thought they're really cool and they're actually really comfortable so these are the only low tops I've got but they are super cool I admit I love my shoes. Maybe it's because I'm the only child and I probably get spoiled more than I probably should. I'm admitting it because I know, but at least I'm not what you call a spoiled brat. Because I love people. Well, I'm antisocial, but I love people. Not everyone, though, because some people are too much for my liking. But these are the low top tailors. I'm going to show you the two big ones last. The next pair I found quite quirky. Because they're probably the most mischievous ones. And these are these ones. And I know but all the others are probably from eBay. But I have no idea where the um, yellow ones are from. Not the low ones though, the high ones. They might be from eBay or they might be from the website. I don't know. I might have a nose later. These are some funky Chuck Martins. Chuck Taylors, not Dark Martins. Chuck Taylors Converse. If I've been saying Dark Martins for the past hour, I'm really sorry. It's just. I love Dark Martins and Converse. I wear my Dark Martins a lot more than I wear my Converse, in my honesty. These ones are like really quirky. You notice some of them have like this sign, and some of them have like um. They're not on these ones. And I can't be bothered to get any of my high top ones. But some of these signs, and these ones are like really different. I uh, love my trainers and I love my boots. I don't wear high heels, even though I've got a pair of high heels at Martins. But my plan is, if I'm staying at school till I'm 19, I'm at least wearing them for the prom, because they didn't let me wear any Doc Martins or Converse last year. Really annoyed me, that did. They should support people's fantasy dreams. So those are these. Well, I've got next pair. I actually have a pair already, well not already, but they're like similar colour to the pairs I've got. And I've got two of these, I've already got one pair that are like these. And these are the high, high, high top that Martin's. They're a one, two, three. 13 hole pair, they're not sure how many holes I've got in my other ones. They're combos, not that Martin's combos. Sorry. These ones are like much suede pairs. And I notice you can fold them, I think. Can you? I can't tell. 
Yes, you can. And I think you can lay seeds up. Um, what am I doing? You can lay seeds up and you can fold these. That is super cool. I'll keep this up, I would. I'm one of those weird people. I'm going to pop this back up because I like the idea of these have fur. But these are like sheep's fur. And they're really cool. I don't actually mind these kind of converses. They're not really quirky. Let's wait for this one. The next pair are very, very similar to my, um, not the ones I've got, but to the orangey ones. I'm going to see if I can find them. If I can find them, because I've got a lot of my wardrobe that is ah here we are temple pretty temple these ones are very similar to these and these thank you for your patience you could see my wardrobe yes I admit it's a mess but I don't care because they're, they're mine so these uh, Chuck Taylor Converse are quite a unique pair because they're like the other two but they're like, they've got braided laces they're really soft, softer than suede they've got really furry inside oh, excuse me <laughs> and I like that these have a unique back as well they're like super cool and i really like them and they're really nice and i'm gonna tell you i have 54 pairs of chuck taylor converse and 17 pairs of dot martins now i was gonna stop at 50 but i might as well stop at either 55 or 60. well i can do that for my birthday and I want to get at least 20, I want to get to 50 pairs of that Martins too, because why not? Though, mind you, I might have to get rid of some of my old shoes, though. But Converse and Doc Martins, never. I might let my cousin borrow, I might. When I say I might, it means I won't, because they're mine. Mine. Thank you for watching this video, and I was joking about that. I'm not spoiled. I did. I will give my cousins my old shoes, which I have already. And thank you for watching this video.